But I wanna thank everyone for riding along today. I hope you enjoy the video and I also in hope, hope that you enjoyed the live stream. So here we go. All right, hello everybody, Dash and Dink coming at you with another day of DoorDash, Instacart, and Spark. Now, what we're doing is we are going to go live in about two hours, but I am done with work. I came into town and we're gonna go ahead and get started with a few orders before we go live. And what I decided to do is I decided to go ahead and take the dot .com. Um, it's only five drops. Uh, it is 23 miles and it is only for $21. However, uh, this will burn up a little bit of time to get me until uh, we go live. So we're going to go ahead and do the dot .com. Uh, I think it's a grand total of like, oh goodness, two items for the one, four items for another, and then one, one, and one. So we're looking at a grand total of six, seven, eight, nine items. Five drops, 21 miles. It says it's gonna take us less than an hour, so we should at least make 20 bucks an hour. And usually, the amount of time that it says it's gonna take me, um, I can usually beat that by, by about five or 10 minutes. So we'll see what happens. But they should be bringing it out here shortly, and we'll go ahead and get started. But I wanna thank everyone for riding along today. I hope you enjoy the video, and I also in hope, hope that you enjoyed the live stream. So here we go. Hi, 2387. <laughs> yeah, I was hoping it would be done by the time I started this whole thing, but I it is. It's not supposed to stop until like yeah. At least the rain. Yeah, we got a little moisture anyway, so. I think it's coming from over there. <laughs> These might be a little wet. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. You as well. Hey guys, uh, I just got the last drop made for that um, dot com, but I wanted to show you guys 
This person lives way freaking back here. I am going to hold this up until we get out to the road. But this is just absolutely wild. I mean, if anyone would have had like a regular car, I don't think they would have even got in here because I'm coming down here where there's some low area. But this place is just, I bet I drove back in here a mile and a half to this person's house. Well, it's a trailer, but it is just way, way back here. See, I'm going off the side or off the main road because it's all just mud over there. And <laughs> oh, wow, this is just crazy. I'm glad I had my truck to be fully honest. Like now it's now we've got like a road, but I went back there where it was just two basically tire tracks in the dirt. <laughs> oh, absolutely crazy. Sorry about the bump there, but all right, we're going to make our way back to town. We did not get this done in time for the next dot com, or excuse me, the next round robin, but um we're gonna go back, we're gonna get set up for the live and hopefully, hopefully everything will be uh, good to go and we'll get some orders tonight. All right guys, we sat for a little while. Um, I did go live, I'm live right now. However, we passed up on a couple of shopping orders. We did pass up on a round robin that was $7 and some change. Uh, for one drop, but it was a lot of items. No tip. I declined that one. Uh, but we did just get a pretty decent offer. It is $43.46, I believe. It's two drops. It is going 13 miles, but both of the drops are very reasonable. It does not say that there are any bulky or heavy items. It just says perishable. So this should be a really decent order and... We're gonna do this, we're gonna get $43 in the bank to go along with the 21 that we've already done. And hopefully we can get back here in time for the next round robin. We'll see you then. Day. Okay. Can I get that code please? Yes, I'm sorry, uh, 2465. All right, it's gonna be a second here, gotta scan everything. That is fine. Apologies about well, the delay today as well, we had a big hit all at once. Yeah, they gave me extra earnings, so I'm all right. <laughs> Works okay, it looks like Dolan might be the bigger one, so I will have you stick those probably in the two totes in the back here. All right. And then I've got another tote in the front seat, and if there's anything left over, I'll throw it in my catering bag. So.
Well, as I made it to the end of my day, I decided to take one last shopping order. It was a good one though, $25.88. It was only to pick up a few items, a couple of half whiskey barrels, some dewormer. <laughs> when I went to get this cat litter, well, the display they had set up just wasn't the right kind of cat litter. So I decided to head to the aisle that it told me to go. And you guessed it, when I got there, nothing but electronics. So I made my way to the back wall because I remembered somewhere in the back of my head, I think this is where they keep all that bulky stuff. And sure enough, as I pulled up, I saw the cat litter and I found the correct one and I got it loaded in the cart. Made my way to the front, loaded everything up, and we got to the customer. As I arrived to the customer, they just wanted it right behind their pickup truck. That was a first for me. So I unloaded everything, snapped a photo, and we finished out the day. Hey everyone. Dashing Dink coming at you again. We are doing a continuation of the Sparking to Arizona. Um, today is currently Thursday, June 6th. Um, I went live a few days ago when we did some Spark. This That was on Monday, uh, June, what, 3rd? And we got a few orders. It wasn't quite enough for a video, so we're gonna do the continuation of that today. I'm just pulling into the Walmart lot now. Um, I'm getting a late start. I had some errands and stuff to run, but it is 11.22. I've got the app on, and we're gonna go back here to the uh, curbside lot and just kind of hang out and wait and see if we get ourselves an order. So, we'll see you guys soon. All right, guys, we just got a curbside. Um, I've been declining shopping orders like crazy. Thursday must be a big, uh, online shopping day for spark drivers to go in and shop but i did just receive a curbside it's not that great it's 2.3 miles it's only 12 dollars um it, it is a small order it's like 36 units or something but uh it's arrived asap we're gonna grab it here real quick and get our day started um you know it's another 12 dollars closer to arizona so i'm gonna go ahead and do it All right, guys, we got that one dropped off and we're heading back to Walmart now to get ready for the next round robin. Um, again, I've still got some of the same shopping orders coming through. You know, they're just not, <laughs> they don't have enough on them to warrant going in and dealing with the massive amounts of crowd that are in Walmart right now. Um, this store is absolutely nuts. I've said it many times after 10 o'clock in the morning 
there's really no sense in going in there unless it is one heck of a good offer. And all these offers that are coming through are 15, 16, 21 for, you know, 30, 40 items. And it's just not enough. So we're going to go back. We're going to see if we can't get ourselves another round robin at the, um, at the 35 after the hour mark, I guess. And um, we'll keep going. But so far, we got 12 bucks in the bank today. And uh, we're working our way towards that 300 for the week. All right, guys, um, they, I did just now accept a shopping order. Um, it's one that's come by a couple of different times, but they finally worked it up. It's $27.28. Uh, it's only going 1.9 miles, and it is shopping for, uh, it looks like it's 16 unique items and like 20, I think 20 total quantity. So it's not too bad. We're gonna just have to go fight the crowd and <laughs> we'll get this order done. Even if it takes us an hour, I guess we're still, we're gonna make $27. guys we are all shopped up and we're currently delivering um you know if i could have been five minutes quicker in the store i i had to look for a couple of uh drinks that this person wanted but if i could have been five minutes in the store i think we would have made it for the round robin but i'm cutting it really close it's currently 12 29 the round robin usually goes through at 35 36 after and it says i'm three minutes away from the drop so i mean maybe but I doubt we're gonna get it so <laughs> I'm trying to get there it all depends on the traffic and so on and so forth but we're making our way All right, guys, we just left. Um, I didn't get around Robin, but I did take another shopping order. This time it's $23 to go 1.5 miles. It's 10 unique items, 11 total quantity. So we're gonna go back and shop. It looks like it's just some random grocery items. So we should just be at the one end of the store and we'll make another 23 bucks. This is gonna put us at like $63 already for the day. Um, which is pretty darn good. We've been out here since 11.30 um, and it is currently 12.37. I think that's right, yeah, 12.37. So um, by the time we get this done, probably gonna be around like 1.15, 1.20 maybe. Uh, we'll be two hours in and we'll be over 60 bucks. So packing on a $30 per hour day, that's pretty good. All right, we'll see you guys when we get done with this.
right guys we got that shopped quick and it is only 1253 so uh since we've got 1.4 miles to go we're gonna go get this dropped off and we'll be back in plenty of time hopefully we'll catch a round robin keep this going um we're just getting past like what is showing today is the slow time of the day and we're getting into the peak time of the day so hopefully things go well and we keep this going um like i said this is going to put us at over 60 bucks in <laughs> actually it'll be less than two hours so pretty darn amazing um day we're having even though i've had to mix in some shopping so we'll see you when we get to the drop All right, guys, we were on our way back. A couple of okay shopping orders came, but one of them was actually really okay. It was 14 items for $24, um, and it was going like 6.8 miles, but I, I let it go a little bit, and I just received a curbside pickup, $40.24 to go 9.2 miles. It's three drops, but it was an arrive ASAP, so we don't even have to wait until the bottom of the hour. Um, it's currently 104 so we're gonna grab this we're gonna get it done it says it's gonna take us 32 minutes so 130 is gonna be our two hour mark this might take us until maybe 145 150 and we're gonna be over 100 bucks in less than three hours so really awesome all right guys we'll see you at pickup Hello. How's it going, guys? guys that last one went to an apartment we've been to many times um, this was a different client however but now we're going to another apartment complex and it's one that um, you need to be let into but it's going to the third floor and they want me to call so they can buzz me in and then I got to go up to the third floor so we're not gonna probably make it back in time for the round robin but that's okay this is a $40 order and we're about five minutes away from being um, two hours in. So this is gonna be so far a, a banging day. I mean, we're probably gonna be about two and a half hours in by the time this order is done, so. Alright guys, um, I made it back to the Walmart curbside lot um, <laughs> and 
it's only two o'clock. It's uh, 209 to be exact. And the dot com came across. Now I decided to take it because it's almost $44. It is 38 miles. It's 15 drops, but I want the 43 bucks. Um, this is going towards my trip and $43 is gonna go a long ways to getting me uh, closer. As a matter of fact, this $43 puts me over my goal for the week um, and for the challenge both. We did 200 last week, we needed to do 300 this week. I needed 20 more dollars to get to 500 bucks. We are there. So, um, gonna go ahead and take it. And uh, they're gonna be bringing it out here shortly. So, we'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, so that's gonna do it for another week. We had another good one, and we're getting ever closer to our trip. I wanna thank you guys for watching, liking, sharing, and commenting on the videos. And I wanna thank you guys again for all the subscriptions lately. You guys have been phenomenal, and I just wanna say that I thank you very, very much. This is Dashing Dink saying, until the next dash. Bye, everyone.